Ah, good evening, good evening, not so it's there, not so it's there, here we are again. Well, now I did a video a week or two ago about uh, Dragon Fallen Puzzles. This game is currently uh, in uh, beta, beta, however you want to pronounce it. Um, but now it has gone to the in-app version of uh, the, you can, you can buy um, stuff on the game. I'm assuming that means that it's sort of headed towards being the official full release because obviously if you if you can buy stuff um i would assume that they can't then turn around and go oh you bought stuff uh you, you bought stuff now you can't have it so um yeah so that's where we are so now in the last video i did i did like i don't know 70 odd summons and i got loads of stuff obviously that isn't gonna happen again um because i am still free to play that is kind of my uh my key uh, where I am, I'm a free-to-play player. I, I'm not somebody who spends money on the games. Um, I, I Now, uh, as I sort of previously mentioned, I do think this game looks absolutely beautiful. I think it's stunning, the the, uh, the set-out of the castle. There, there's my, my stronghold. Uh, now, this was the Watchtower. It's now been changed to a Dragon Tower. Um, my dragon can go off and do different things. So this is this is new. I, I have a crystal dragon, one star. Um, up guard, it says. I, I was just thinking that's probably a mistake, but count of all dragon watches on top. So my, my dragon's gone off to do something, but I, I have various. There are dragons. I, I'm not sure entirely sure what's going on with them at the minute. Um, I really like this this area here. This I think just just looks looks lovely. This is the shop area of the game where I can buy stuff, and uh, now obviously I can buy stuff. Uh, not that I'm going to, because I'm still free, a free player. But um, yeah, you know, there's stuff to buy by there. Um, my town, uh, the, you know, the, the town itself, I, I would say, you know, that's, that's not that amazing to look at. It's, it's a standard um, empires and puzzles, stroke, etc., etc. There are numerous games which have lovely, you know, you build your castle, oh, it develops, oh, look, it gets stronger and whatever else have you. And um, you get told that it looks rubbish. You know, you, you'll hear it say, oh, it needs upgrading. It's like, it already looks way amazing. Um, if you go and look at, I mean, I, I live in the UK and there's loads of castles in the UK uh, and most of them don't even come close to uh, looking Actually, to be fair, no no castle in the UK looks anything like uh, as good as this this sort of stronghold in the middle. I mean, you you you're looking at well, yeah, no, they don't. I mean, castles. I mean, the, the, this huge tower in the middle is just hugely impractical. Um, you you just wouldn't get that. Um, there's my dragon. Um, but you wouldn't get it. I mean, anyway, there we are. Never mind. Um, these are obviously fantasy games and so on and so forth. Um, so that's uh, yeah. That said, I I do love the graphics on this game. I think it's it's really nicely done. Um, I am on a level four of the mutant forest. Uh, you can see again, you know, the mobs are sort of fairly standardish. It's it's basically at the minute this game is is the graphics that have got me hooked in. Uh, although there are obviously there do appear to be a couple of small issues with uh with the devs um a couple of times the game has done weird things to me uh in terms of you know uh gen generally just just to playability a couple of little things um i can't even specifically put my head on them uh head to head my hands on them right now uh, a couple of times i've got you know i've pressed something and it's just not nothing's happened and so on and so forth um so that's you know potentially an issue but at the same time it does seem like a very strong game at the moment um as you can see tiles are flying around like mad boom, 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 boom. um i haven't really focused in too much on the story um but well as with most of these games the story is almost incidental um bad stuff has happened but basically in this in this one there is uh there are various dragons that need to be reunited to save the world and so on and so forth and my my dragon that is flying around is in some way related to that uh, i managed to hatch my dragon egg which is what you do as part of the tutorial so i've gone through the i've gone through the tutorial phases and am now sort of 
on the free play stage, uh, at least early on. No space for additional resource recruits. Thank you very much. So, um, yeah, so there there is a lot to be going on with. Um, I believe, I don't think, yeah, uh, I have to get through Chapter 4 before I can join Alliance, which uh, obviously once I'm through Chapter 4, it's going to be worth joining, joining an Alliance. Uh, I'm not going to try and set up, well, I did previously set up one of my own, but I think it probably makes sense to uh, just join an Alliance of relatively active players and sort of try and develop my strength. Because obviously I'm I'm here nice and early in the game. Ooh, my my dragon is roosting. Does that mean? Does that mean I can do stuff with my dragon? Crystal dragon. So here's my crystal dragon. Um, can I upgrade? You cannot evolve dragon once he's on tour. He's not on tour. He's back. Oh oh, he's gone off to the for forgotten desert. So I'm not entirely sure how the dragon thing is working at the minute. This this is all very new. Um, no, obviously I've only got a level one dragon. Uh, I'm assuming dragons can be upgraded and get onto. Uh, I'm I'm confused by the whole dragon thing. It, this is something completely new. No, it's nice to see something new on the games. Uh, obviously the match three games. Um, you know I've I've done empires and puzzles, puzzle combat, Z and puzzles, and so on and so forth. Um, to to see one which which is really sort of. You know, doing something a bit different is it, nice. I'm, you know, I'm quite pleased by that. Uh, I'm just upgrading my tower here because obviously I can upgrade uh, as I go along. Uh, I'm short of iron, which is going to be my next thing is to, to get a load of iron and just you know carry on and see how we go. But there we are. So um, there we are. So this this is day one on um, beta, but with in-app purchases, which I'm hoping means that it will sort of you know that it will turn into um the the main release of the game um because or well it's, it's one of the things obviously if you, if you buy stuff in a game they can't then take it away from you so uh, i think they will have to to head for uh you know a, a proper release fairly soon i think uh, i could be wrong and you know if i am i do apologize um uh, you know obviously I, as, as i repeatedly say i'm a free player and I'm not uh, influenced by the, the uh, devs at all. But uh, you know, I'm just trying it and seeing where we go. So anyway, um, thank you for watching. Do please remember to like, share, comment and subscribe. I'm sorry this was a bit of a rambling video because I'm still sort of uh, finding my way around this game. Um, I, I, as, I, as I keep saying, I do think it's visual, visually stunning. It remains to be seen if the, game, to be seen if the gameplay... Uh, etc can match up to that i'm liking elements of it i do like the the idea of the dragon dragon tower which this is my dragon tower here um i'm th thinking that could potentially be quite entertaining uh, anyway there we are so we shall see we shall see anyway thank you very much for watching do please remember to like share comment and subscribe and it just remains for me to say uh may death come swiftly to your enemy hover and goodbye